In this video, I'm going to show you how you can compare the first half of the product that's scanned in to the product that's on your list. For this example, we have the supplier giving you the product code of their, their product that they're shipping. And then that actual number that's on the, on the box or on the product is actually longer because it includes other things like the date and the weight and that type of thing. So when you scan in these um, barcodes, you would normally not be able to match them. But what we're going to show you is how we can do this. So I'm copying this, this number, which is very long. And I'm pasting it into the scanning box here. And there you go. The product is identified and the, the time and uh, date is put in there. So let's try another one. So I'm copying this long number and this is the same as if you're scanning it in. And there you go. The second product is highlighted. Now, let me show you the code. The code is very simple. Because we're looking for part of the value and not the whole value, we can't search. So we have to go individual cells. So the only thing I've declared is row and last row. And the last row is determined from going from the bottom up. So I'm saying that if the barcode value cell is not blank, then what you're going to do is go to the top row, go in the for loop from the top row, to the last row, and then you're comparing the left of R1 to the first the first 15 characters of the left value of R1 to the first 15 characters of the left value of the barcode. If it, if it matches, then you're changing the background color to green, and you're putting the date and time in here. I will, of course, include the code in the description of my video. Please subscribe.